Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Today we will talk about the steps of in vitro fertilization or IVF. What is IVF? IVF or in vitro fertilization is a complex series of procedures used to help with the fertility or prevent the genetic problems and assist with the conception of a child. During IVF, mature eggs are collected or retrieved from the ovaries and fertilized by sperm in a lab. In vitro fertilization or IVF brings the miracle of conceptions into laboratory. It has led to the birth of nearly 10 million babies since the first successful fertilization procedure in 1978. How does it work? Let's take a closer step-by-step -step look at the process. Step number one is preparation. The IVF treatment process begins long before any egg removal and fertilization takes place. A patient will need a thorough medical history before treatment begins. Plus, fertility tests and analysis for the patient and her husband are required. As the procedure gets closer, a patient may be considered with the contraceptive pills or estrogen to control the timing of her menstrual cycle and maximize the number of eggs. Step number two is ovarian stimulation by using injectable hormones. During a typical ovarian cycle, only one egg becomes mature enough to ovulate. IVF uses injectable hormonal medications to bring a group of eggs to maturity to increase odds of a successful pregnancy. The type, dosage and frequency of medication is tailored specifically to a patient for optimal results. Monitoring of the eggs may occur daily or every few days during this time to de determine when they get mature. A final trigger shot is given exactly 36 hours before the scheduled egg retrieval to finalize the maturation process. Step number three, egg retrieval. Once the eggs are mature, it's time for egg retrieval. During this step, a suction device connected to a long thin needle is inserted through the patient's vagina. This punctures the ovarian follicles and pull the mature eggs out. Removed eggs are placed in a petri dish containing a special solution and then placed in an incubator for a short period of time. Since this procedure is mildly invasive, medication and sedations are used for the patient's comfort. Step number four is fertilization. Fertilization of the eggs take place within a day. During a procedure known as intracytoplasmic sperm injection, a single sperm is introduced into each mature egg. On the average, about 70% of mature eggs will successfully fertilize. Step number five is embryo development. So now comes the growing and waiting. Fertilized eggs are monitored and left to develop over the next several days with the cells actively dividing. About half of the fertilized embryos will progress to blastocyst stage when they are suitable for transfer into the uterus. Embryos that are suitable for transfer can either be used right away or frozen for future transfer. Step number six, embryo transfer. Within a week after fertilization, it's time to transfer the embryo. This is a short procedure that only takes about 10 minutes and feels very similar to pelvic examination or pap smear. A speculum is placed within the vagina and a thin catheter is inserted through the cervix into the uterus. An embryo or embryos are then injected through the catheter into the uterus. After an embryo transfer, a patient may experience symptoms such as mild bloating and cramping, breast tenderness from high estrogen level along with other symptoms like spotting and constipation. Step number seven is pregnancy. Within 14 days after embryo transfer, a blood test will be done to determine if a patient is pregnant or not. If the pregnancy test is positive, she begins the journey of prenatal care. Pregnancy success rate per embryo transfer vary depending on the age of woman at the time of egg retrieval. If the pregnancy test is negative, a patient can try another embryo transfer if she has additional embryos frozen from the first IVF cycle. If a patient doesn't have remaining embryos, she can try IVF again. IVF has been used successfully for more than four decades. So thank you so much. That was a short video about the steps of IVF.
سبسکرائب آن آپس اینڈ گائیڈنگ اللہ حافظ